guys, Lawrence here, and it's the first of the month, or this month being December. And I'm in front of our little Christmas tree here, and the reason why we don't have a big one this year, because since we're going to Japan, we wouldn't really have that much time with a big tree. So we wanted to just have a little one, just that means we are celebrating Christmas, because we do love Christmas here, don't we, Philly? Yeah! But there's also one part of Christmas and the December the 1st that everybody loves, and that's getting to open advent calendars. So. This year is no exception, and I decided to treat myself. Philly's got one, it's a Milky Bar one, but my one, Reese's! Hashtag not spawn. So, yeah, I think I know what's gonna be inside one of these, and that number one is right here. And would you look at that? It's a Reese's peanut butter cup. <gasps> Who'd have thunk it? I am gonna eat it right now. Oh, forgot to take the paper off. This is good content. So today was relatively straightforward. It being a Saturday, we did our shop in the morning and then we went down to our local frost fair. And unfortunately, there was no Dragon Ball Super Frost anywhere. It was a relatively small one. And as you can see from some of the footage that we got, it did get pretty crowded, but there was some really good stuff in there as well, including some very festive bath bombs right here, an assortment of disco ball baubles, and my own personal favorite, some wonderful Christmas fudge. As said in the Christmas Tree of Might, I absolutely love the idea of fun times and Christmas fudge. Ow. Oh yeah, it's definitely alcoholic. Yeah, it tastes like Christmas cake. So even though we only spent like about an hour there, we did have a really good time and we got some ideas about what we might have wanted to do for Christmas. So starting today, I'm going to be doing a little mini vlog every day, or at least there is going to be content on this very channel every day until we pretty much are in Japan, really. So I might try and see if we can carry that through all the way into Christmas Day. Who knows? Or dares to dream. And meanwhile, um, Philly's actually been doing some work on the Christmas brief that's going out on the front door. So over to Philly about what's going on there. Your mum started a tradition, and she always does, mm -hmm. do a real reef every year. Yeah. So one year she got me um, a wooden frame to do it with. So we're mm. going to start today by using any foliage that I can find in our garden. And then I might need to go to your mum's garden and my parents' garden to find some things to make it a bit more... Christmassy? Christmassy or pingy. So at the moment we've got just some ivy. You have to pick things that are evergreen. So we've got some ivy... Um, and there are some ivy berries in there too, which are quite nice. They're like a dark blue. And then we've got some conifer, but not like your normal conifer. It's one of um, co a column, a, co a column, yeah. One that grows as a column. So we're just gonna start with the green stuff and then like, with a couple of light berries and things. And then hopefully tomorrow we'll have a bit, few more bits and then it can go up on the front door. So that'll be really, really good. Cool. Here we are. You impressed with that, Philly? Yeah, it's good for the beginning stages. We'll um, probably add something like holly or something like that, and then I've got to add the bow to end. But I actually quite like it with just um, the green and the dark kind of ivy berries. It looks quite good. Cool. So I know one thing we could add. Gin. So in a few days' time, it's going to look absolutely jolly and festive, and I will be sharing that on my social medias, so do check that out when it is all good and done. So yeah, tomorrow is gonna be mainly just going around the local markets as well as going down to see my parents to go and have Sunday lunch. And also doing some little bit behind the scenes work on something that you started to see on my, again, social medias. I'm being very active there, aren't I? Something to do with a little Christmas Goku. And you'll be seeing exactly what he gets up to throughout the month of December. So stay tuned for that one. And until next time, guys, I hope you're doing well. I hope you're having a very good December so far. And once again, one is glad to be of service.